Hi, this is Tomo. Thank you so much for watching my YouTube channel, Tomo Fujita Music. Today, I'm going to show you a really simple song, but really nice chord changes. A lot of seventh chord and three levels. Okay, so the first one, you're going to learn all the seventh chords. And then I will show you a really simple way to approach the scale, but not too difficult way. It's really simple. Okay, and the third one, your favorite, my favorite. We're gonna learn triads. Okay, here we go. So now you wanna hear a little bit backing track that I made. This one I use Boss RC3. RC3, I can say. Uh, you know, um, root pedal. And then I, I made a, a very simple one. Just listen to So the first part is this. Really simple. So here. So, okay, first one, D flat major seventh. So I play here from fifth string root, root, fifth, major seventh, major third. I have a fifth on too, but okay. So this is major seventh, really nice chord, right? The next one, C seven. So this one, very useful, root, fifth, plus seven, a major third and a fifth. Now, third chord is F minor. So, as the chord changes, so the, sort of sounds like a new key, D flat, very nice D flat, then C. This is called five seven of one, which is F minor. So you gradually, if you learn theory, uh, easy to categorize things. Theory is not really um, m no magic, really. It's just like a, you know, how to categorize music, you know, like that, and then. Now here, same chord, chord, chord shape, E flat minor seven, A plus seven. So now, this A plus seven root five plus seven major third fifth. And root either. So you learn that slowly. Okay, so now second step, it's a really simple way to play minor scale. So when you learn scale, um, a lot of people teach, learn um, more of a vertical motion. It's easy to play, but sometimes you want to know, know side by side, side so that you know every detail. So for example, root and next one second means whole step minor third one and a half step fourth fifth now flat six if you subscribe my guitar wisdom there's a section called theory so this all you know uh, I cover so you know you understand completely now here
minor pentatonic. So even like a play minor pentatonic, like a one, one. Just a second. Make sure. Okay, so you see, <laughs> like that. Very important, you know, very important to know one note at a time, right? So, next, third one, third topic is triads. You know, triads. But see, this one really tricky. First one's D flat, which is like that. Little, you know, D flat. But great, next chord is C, which is very common. Now here, you wanna do C, Do, Mi, So. Mi, So, Do. So, Do, Mi. Like that. Very nice. Especially now, I, I use two delay to cover my mistakes, you know. Perfect. That's how we do it. <laughs> yeah. So here, C triad. A lot of reverb. That's okay. Now, so, and then F minor. Very useful. But, if you know F minor, you should know F major. So F major, like this. So that's the first inversion. Details more in the guitar wisdom here. Minor third. Minor third. So this way, you don't have to memorize, you don't need any tablature, because you understand one topic, one item at a time. Then you change that. So basically, this way you own everything. You don't borrow anything. You just own. Okay? But you have to own first major, major triads. Okay? So you go. E flat. A flat. So this way. Now this backing track, I made um, basic chord changes, and then usually I use I use a little bit like this, um, uh, like uh, this. Uh, let's see, what do you call? Yeah, chorus. <laughs> this is called dimension. Dimension C. So this way.
That's it. Okay. So work on seventh chord, melody, one note at a time, one string, and triads. That's it. And then extra I play, but that's like a spice. So once you know how to cook basic cooking, and after that, you know how to add a spice. Definitely you know. You have a good taste. All right. So see you soon. Bye.